Did you know that darts players can hate each other tremendously on stage, but just have a good time afterwards? The sport of darts might be signified by good humour and high-level entertainment, but over the years, there have been plenty of bitter rivalries and controversial moments when the players have lost their cool too. There have been a few instances in the history of darts where players have had intense rivalries and openly expressed their dislike for each other. Phil Taylor versus Raymond Van Barneveld. Perhaps the most famous rivalry in the history of darts, Phil Taylor and Raymond Van Barneveld had a heated rivalry that spanned several years. Their rivalry was fueled by intense matches, close finishes, and controversial incidents. They openly expressed their dislike for each other and refused to shake hands after matches. They have contested in various knockout matches and have had some heated moments at the big stage. However, in later years, they reconciled and became friends. Adrian Lewis versus Raymond Van Barneveld. Adrian Lewis and Raymond Van Barneveld had a heated rivalry that began in the late 2000s. They exchanged heated words during matches at the 2012 Grand Slam of Darts. Lewis accused Van Barneveld of gamesmanship. During the match, Van Barneveld was taking a significant amount of time before throwing his darts, which Lewis felt was a deliberate attempt to disrupt his rhythm and throw him off his game. In one match, Lewis even walked off the stage refusing to shake Van Barneveld's hand. Adrian Lewis versus Peter Manley. The 2006 PDC World Darts Championship match between Adrian Lewis and Peter Manley was a controversial one. The controversy stemmed from an incident that occurred during the match, which was resulted in accusations of gamesmanship and unsportsmanlike behaviour. During the match, Manley accused Lewis of deliberately slowing down the pace of the game, which is against the rules of darts. Manley felt that Lewis was taking too long to retrieve his darts from the board, which was disrupting his rhythm and concentration. Manley complained to the referee, who warned Lewis to speed up his play. Lewis then walked off as he was annoyed, complaining that Manley was muttering and distracting him while he was throwing his darts. At the end, he returned and lost 3-5 to Manley, but surely both players will remember this match forever. Adrian Lewis versus Peter Wright. The controversy between Adrian Lewis and Peter Wright occurred during the 2021 PDC World Darts Championship. Adrian Lewis and Peter Wright fought a hard match, which Wright won 6-5. Following Wright's victory, a heated exchange took place between the two players while they were still on stage, with Lewis looking particularly unhappy and ended up being led away by a member of security staff. The incident caused a heated exchange between the two players and also led to criticism from fans and commentators alike. The Professional Darts Corporation, PDC, later investigated the incident, but ultimately decided not to take any disciplinary action against either player. Adrian Lewis has accused Peter Wright of being a cheat. Lewis felt that Wright took him out his rhythm. He had a game plan, which was disgraceful for the game. Lewis felt that Wright started murmuring things when Lewis was in control of the game 3-1, which made him uncomfortable. Lewis also took this matter to Twitter. Wright, on the other hand, said that he does not care about Lewis's opinions and only wants to focus on the future matches. What do you think about this? Kindly tell us in the comments section. James Wade versus Simon Whitlock. The controversy between James Wade and Simon Whitlock occurred during the quarterfinals of the 2018 European Championship Darts Tournament. During the match, James Wade was seen to celebrate in a confrontational manner after hitting a crucial double. This celebration was directed towards Simon Whitlock and included a gesture that appeared to be mimicking the way in which Whitlock throws his darts. Whitlock took offence to the gesture and confronted Wade about it, with the two players exchanging words and needing to be separated by the referee. After the match, Whitlock accused Wade of being disrespectful and unsportsmanlike, while Wade claimed that a celebration was simply a reaction to the tension of the match. The incident caused a lot of controversy and received widespread media attention, with many fans and commentators criticising Wade for his behaviour. The professional darts corporation PDC later fined Wade for his actions, but he was not disqualified from the tournament. Don't forget to hit the bullseye to subscribe to our channel, so you never miss out on any of our amazing darts videos. Now, back to the video. Gary Anderson vs Wesley Harms. Probably the most unique controversy which occurred due to a fart. This match happened at the Grand Slam of Darts. In the Grand Slam of Darts, Professional Darts Corporation PDC players faced competitors from the rival British darts organisation BDO. Gary Anderson and Wesley Harms both complained of a foul smell during the match, although neither was willing to take responsibility. Wesley Harms, 34, accused the Scotsman of leaving a fragrant smell on the stage during the match. Two-time PDC World Champion Gary Anderson, 47, won the match on Friday 10-2 to progress to the quarterfinals, but his Dutch opponent said he'll 
it'll take me two nights to lose this smell from my nose. These were Harms' words in a post-match interview with Dutch television station RTL7L. Anderson accused Harms of farting as he felt that Harms performed better after that. He even swore on his kids that he was not the culprit. After vehemently denying any involvement in producing the smell, Anderson began to cast aspersions onto the other people on the stage, including experienced caller Russ Bray the referee, and even the scorer. This was a messed up controversy, which was even unique and strange for PDC chairman Barry Hearn. Michael Van Gerwen and Rob Cross. Michael Van Gerwen and Rob Cross are two of the biggest names in darts, but they have had a few run-ins on the dartboard. Michael lost to 10 to seven to Cross in the Masters. He was quite annoyed by his opponent's attitude during the match. He delivered another sneer to Cross by stating that the PDC didn't select him because he was a boring player. He also said that he finds the silly laughing and cynical stuff that Cross does to be weird. In 2019, Van Gerwen accused Cross of not showing respect to him after the Premier League and the two players exchanged heated words. Peter Wright versus Suljevic feud. The feud between Peter Wright and Mensil Suljevic began during the 2017 Champions League of Darts tournament. During their group match, Suljevic was seen to take issue with Wright's choice of darts, claiming that they were illegal under the rules of the game. Wright, however, denied any wrongdoing and accused Suljevic of trying to gain an advantage by disrupting his focus. The incident caused a heated exchange between the two players, with Suljevic accusing Wright of cheating, and Wright responding by suggesting that Suljevic was a sore loser. The feud continued after the match, with both players making comments to the media about each other. The controversy led to a discussion in the darts community, with fans and commentators divided over who was in the right. Despite the controversy, Wright and Suljevic continued to play each other in subsequent tournaments. However, the feud between them remained a talking point and was often cited as an example of the tension and rivalry that can exist between players at the highest level of the sport. Price v Anderson The incident between Gerwin Price and Gary Anderson occurred during the quarterfinals of the 2020 PDC World Darts Championship. During the match, tensions between the two players boiled over after Price claimed that Anderson had tried to disrupt his rhythm during a crucial leg. Price reacted angrily to the perceived interference which led to a heated exchange between the two players. The incident caused a lot of controversy and received widespread media attention, with many fans and commentators criticising Price for his behaviour. Anderson later revealed that he had received abuse from some sections of the crowd following the incident, which added to the overall sense of hostility. The professional darts corporation, PDC, investigated the incident and fined Price a record £21,500 for his behaviour which was seen as being particularly unsportsmanlike. The incident between Price and Anderson remains a talking point in the history of darts and is often cited as an example of the importance of sportsmanship and respect in the game. Lewis versus Whitlock. The incident between Adrian Lewis and Sam Whitlock during the 2013 PDC World Darts Championship and related to Lewis's celebrations during the match. During the semi-finals, Lewis celebrated after hitting a crucial double, which included a confrontational gesture towards Whitlock. This gesture was seen as being disrespectful by some fans and commentators, and Whitlock took offence to it. After the gesture, Whitlock confronted Lewis and the two players exchanged words, with the referee having to intervene to separate them. After the match, Whitlock accused Lewis of being unsportsmanlike and claimed that he had disrespected both him and the game of darts. The incident caused a lot of controversy, with many fans and commentators criticising Lewis for his behaviour. However, Lewis defended himself stating that he was caught up in the moment and that he had not intended to cause offence. Don't forget to hit the bullseye to subscribe to our channel so you never miss out on any of our amazing darts videos. See you next time.